We did ask all our studio guests to choose somebody that they wanted to champion for International Women's Day 2018. Now, this person could be male, female, dead, alive, famous or not. Um, So I cannot wait to hear who you've chosen. Jade, let's start with you, first of all. Who have you chosen and why? I've chosen my granddad. (laughs) Oh, why is that? Well, he's an absolute legend to start with. Um, But I'm his eldest female grandchild. There's only my cousin Danny who's a lad obviously that's older than me and nothing that I ever wanted to do as a child or um, anything really was out of the realms of possibility and I used to go to work with him in the summer holidays probably more of a hindrance than help Um, but he'd have me not work but just help him with like the wallpaper and tables and that sort of thing and just nothing was a problem to do and it was never like you're a girl you can't do that he was super supportive when I went to college and did engineering and when I took the notion that I wanted to get a motocross bike never happened but he did say he'd go guarantor on the finance for me (laughs) um like just nothing has ever been too much for him and he's the most he would never call himself a feminist but he's the most secret feminist in my entire life. And that's wonderful from that generation, isn't it? Yeah, he's in, he's incredible and he's always willing to learn. Like, he never just shuts off and has the attitude of it's a different time, I have a different attitude. He's, he's just amazing, amazing, amazing person. Really lucky to have him. And I actually feel like a bit emotional as well. (laughs) Yeah, I think we are. (laughs) Wonderful. So that's Jay's choice. Grania, tell us who you have chosen and why. And um, just stick your fingers in uh, crocheted Frida's ears there because it's not her. Yes. Uh, Well, the women of man, actually, on on Instagram, I've shared all of our iconic um, females that we really admire. So just to go away from the international and a bit closer to home, and since it's Mother's Day on Sunday... I really want to say my mum because she is honestly the most level-headed, generous woman and she's ace in a crisis, always problem solves and just, she's brilliant. Oh, <laughs> oh very lovely. lovely. It is lovely. Yeah. Okay, and Stacy, who have you chosen? I feel a bit bad now, so apologies to any of my family listening. <laughs> um, but I've actually gone with Bessie Coleman. Now, I teach history as part of my job, and one of the things I was looking at was inequalities in America, and through this, I discovered Bessie. So in 19. 19- 21 she achieved a national pilot's license and was the first woman of african-american descent and the first woman of native american descent to actually have a pilot's license and her intent was to be able to start a flying school for african-americans in the u.s because she actually had to travel to paris to get her license um she was offered roles in certain films because of her amazing stunt pilot work as well um but actually ended up turning them down because she refused to take the part despite the money because of the way it portrayed black people wow 